hi guys welcome back to my channel it's a girl Bieber. anyways i'm back to the screen giving you guys another juicy content but today i'm going to be discussing some some topics i feel like a lot of people need to caution themselves on with my friend yeah let's get into it real quick Boom. welcome back guys um i don't have to introduce this auntie right here because she's yeah, everywhere on my channel exactly. i feel like right now i should you guys <laughs> i'm for like the newcomers. <laughs> okay for the newcomers me and my friend ada welcome back to my channel this is my friend ada she's always like my gist body anyways so today I want to like just on some topics that i feel like a lot of people need to caution themselves on i think the first topic should be what do you think about girls that are closer to their friends man <laughs> to me that's weird like i'm wrong in all levels guy i feel why like why would i bring you to my man's house and you become friends with him what are two of you doing see you guys need to see, explain what a lot of things on? doesn't sound or look right yeah, why are you yeah. besties with your friend's man what the Not fuck is besties, going on like people people are besties with their friend's man when you guys met through me that's how best <laughs> if you start see, going to the house they'll not carry you and go see, <laughs> you become the see, if we, <laughs> oh, yeah, oh see even 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 if yeah even if you guys didn't meet through her the moment you know that these people are in a relationship yeah, i feel like you should call respect you need to caution yeah. yourself you need to have manners why are you being best with another person like you man? want her to do that to you so even if you do? even if you want it it's, it's not just nice it's just like um yeah with your boyfriend i'll just come and say your boyfriend and i'm like hi <laughs> I'm dead. Like, I'm dead. This is a general warning to my friends. I know you guys can be very comfortable around me, but, but please <laughs> don't see me with my boyfriend and you become so excited or, to go and sit on his leg. How about those friends that they try going to make on? you look stupid when you have your man? They start asking you. To those kind dance. of people, I feel like they are, they're they are friends. jealous of right. you. That's why I feel like they're jealous of you and. Yeah. they don't even like you i think they like your man because why are you trying to make me feel yes, why are you making me look bad stupid in, front in front of my, of my man, man. Like, no girl See, you're if supposed you to know... have my back you're not supposed to do some sexy stupid thing exactly or something you know i'm not aware of don't even, i say. feel like there are some things that are even weird with your friends man don't be too attached don't be all over the place you just need to yeah. be cautioned have manners these things are basic things have manners it is not what so hard don't do it to others please That's don't be all up in your friend's man instagram page commenting bestie this one like dropping love in the emoji Le wow. what sure. if you do the that happened. how do you guys go that far though like why are you following my man why are you <laughs> no i can't like you following <laughs> but why are you not commenting are you not drop love emoji two of you will explain what happened behind <laughs> my back because something must have led to that the, see the anyway. one that i'm even funny the, the one that's very funny is i heard some girls dm their friend man say thank you for what you do for my friend mm. what's your business is, is that really what you are for <laughs> is it really <laughs> Anyway, let's not waste much of your time. Just tell us what you think about that. Yeah, that that's actually very wrong, and I feel like a lot of people okay. need to stop it. How about this? Which one? Your man having a female bestie. I think. <laughs> what, is, like, what do you think? Can you make a man that has a female best see, friend? It is never like possible. Like and Jesse, it, it's not possible. See, if I can't have a man that have a female, what happens to me? Use me as your female no, best. Why are you having a female friend. best friend? You can have. Friends, Especially which is good because I have, you're have male to friends too. It, and then the girl doesn't have boundaries. See, okay. the moment a guy have a female best friend, I think there's something going on. Even if there's nothing going on, I still feel yeah. it's some kind of weird. Because why are you having a female best friend when you have a girl? At the only way I won't mind is if the girl has boundaries and if me and the girl. Yeah, have really it is. It is really like cool. Respect our privacy, yeah, but most of them do not. That's the thing. Like, they do not. See, it is normal when your friend, your man has couple of male female friends or female bestie they are very yeah. caution they know what to do at the right time they don't they're not always in your space they do the right thing they are not all these bestie bestie vibe they're always on the phone with him always yeah, in the space like, always trying to hang he out he calls her more than he calls you guys there's, there's some i feel like i don't know if girls yeah, find that thing really comfortable but i feel like you guys need to caution yourself yeah if your guy friend is in a relationship you need to have sense and give him some boundaries yeah respect give him space it is it is her. just normal even if this girl doesn't act like she's jealous 
the normal human sense just have the sense that you need to call yourself. To, like, give them their space. Do not call when she's there. Don't call him around self again. What the fuck is wrong with you? Except it's an emergency, though. Yes, but you Except. Be dying, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's the serious. Sorry. Anyway, our third question is: If you find out your okay, this is deep. Let me if see. you find out your dad cheated on your mom, will you tell her? No, please. <laughs> It's not that was cut out my parents' relationship. It's but so, guys, this is so painful. Like, it's yeah, really, it is really very painful. painful when you know that your dad is cheating on your mom. But I have a friend. I don't think I want to. Are you serious? Yeah, but I don't actually. think I want to make my mom that sad. It's normal if she yeah. find out herself. But I would not want to be the one to tell her. Exactly, she should find out herself. I'll or probably something. try to talk to my dad, but trying to. I can't. Have to see, I don't know the kind of father other mom. people have, but I don't think I can have that kind of conversation with my dad. <laughs> I rather not know. Exactly. Please let me not know. Please because let me not know. I don't, I don't want to know. know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to start sitting my dad down. See, so that kind of. It what is just made. I'm a typical African Yoruba girl that grew yeah, up in a Yoruba did not home. Train you to I'm come not out like that. That kind of rubbish. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I'm supposed to have that kind of conversation with my dad. Dad, please don't. No, please. Mm -hmm. I rather not know. Be in my please, space. Mind my know, business. But if I'm, I do know. I feel like I'll see my my business. I'm not going to talk about. My business, I'm not going to talk about try it. To, I don't know. I'm not to going to want to make my mom feel sad. My friend, when he calls his dad, yeah, he does that that she him money. I wish I would. I, <laughs> that one is just a dream. That's blackmailing. The father just sent him. Just say, hey, hello, Toby, how are you? Eh, uh, send your girl <laughs> That one is blackmailing. <laughs> and the man is already having guilty conscience. <laughs> what the fuck? That, that's anyway, what I, I rather like, don't know, Sha. Yeah, Please, me too. I rather, I don't want to know what's going on in my parents' to. relationship. And I think my dad is except, ex <laughs> <laughs> Yes, that's the vibe. Yes, you know this. Remen and Don't youth. cheat. They, they don't fucking exist, so yeah. Of course. And that's a period. <laughs> so, our fourth question, guys. What's is, the first question? Can you be a man that always picks his guy over you? No, I can't. I know his a lot guys, of guys. Actually, his guys See, there's a guy code where I feel like when your guy's in a relationship, you should give him space. Yes, yeah, you love girlfriend. Most of these guys these days, they are so uncultured. They are always in your nigger space. You don't have right. manners. And you don't give him bad advice because then they don't have a girlfriend. Yes, so even yeah. if they have a girlfriend, but I feel like you, there should be a time where you just allow your guy be with his girl. Yeah, get like you're always you're That's always wanting point. to go out with your guy. You're always everywhere in his space. Even if guys live together, there should still be some yes, consciousness. No, like, I know this your, your boundaries. boundaries. Should we start? Like, but I feel like be a class on boundaries because. People don't have boundaries. Yes, anymore. like a lot of us boundaries. don't have boundaries. You just want to be in everybody's space, be in everybody's spaces, and it is irritating. Most of no, most when of, you are wanted, <laughs> you are not needed. <laughs> but, but I feel like most of these guys they just always want to be yeah, like guys without guys. thinking. But I think what your girlfriend is. I think also in the guy's use. place to tell his friends like, "Gee, yeah, yeah, yeah exactly." Because maybe some guys, let's, exactly. let's the friends don't know. Yeah. So why don't you tell them respect my girl like she's yeah. walking around and I want to have like, right exactly, time but around, so. but I feel like some sensible guy should know when to give their friends yeah, in case space. the guys are sensible, sensible. <laughs> your boyfriend should be like able that. to tell your, your boyfriend should be able to like tell his friend like guy i'm you, my baby exactly can we do this later give us our space yeah it is very simple like that very very simple did you get so our fifth question yeah is can you be a man yeah that can cook and then expects you to cook every fucking time. I feel like, like <laughs> this is a Yoruba man thing. Like, yeah, most of the she's time. She's a Yoruba, but she can agree with me. Like, of course, is this is what like, Yoruba guys what, like to do. I don't like it. I feel like see a lot of girls out. in this generation not like they don't like to cook, but I feel like a lot of people are not caught up into doing a lot of things mm, that they don't like have the time themselves. to cook. Me, it's not like I don't like cooking. And it's not really. It shouldn't be a woman thing because then there are not boys the that love cooking. Yes, and I have a lot of guys, guys that, that like chefs. Cooking. Like yes, yes, like some people literally see cooking as a hobby. They don't see it they as a problem. They, they can cook. They want to cook. They're, they're every done, time. They still but the moment a guy start like making that. it obligatory to you, it, yes, exactly. like, like you have to cook for me. I don't know. I feel I like don't you just out. Oh, I can't eat still food. Oh my god. You, you cannot eat 
still feel bro, you everyday. should get a chef. Fresh food every day. Get a, get a chef. I think if people need, job now. Yeah. I think like you, you need a full housewife or you need to get And if yeah, if chef. you're lucky enough to have a woman that wants to be a full housewife, then yeah. good for you. But if you are not, I don't think I, you should I, I just feel like you should not be a criteria for love. Exactly. Yeah. When men try to make it oh before I marry a before I be with a girl, she has to want to cook every time. Yeah. Don't do that. Like do you love her for cooking or do you love her? But people feel like it's supposed her? to be like a topping to the whole thing. Like you should know how to cook. Yeah, like exactly. If no, it's extra. If your girl mm. loves to do it, fine. Mm. But if she doesn't, you shouldn't make her feel bad. Do you know what like, I feel? Whenever I... she feels like fine. Yeah. Whenever you feel like fine. Yeah. If you don't feel like then but some, most, some guys don't, eat they out. don't want to help. They That's... don't want to. They just feel like because she's my I... girlfriend or because she's my wife. Let me tell you guys something. My dad is in the nineties. Yeah, my dad is an older man. But at this point, my dad don't force my mom to cook. No. Like he literally, he literally, he literally calls home and be like, um, "Where is at home? If there's no food, it's okay." They don't force it. And you see some lazy, so, lazy nineties so nice. kids mm, so, just pop up on their girlfriend and tell the girl like, "You need to cook for me because I'm coming." Or some of you need to have manners. You're, you're not even married. married. You, you shouldn't she talk. And she's tired. Stress. She had a long she has, day. She had to like work. She, she, ah, bad. Like that's not I, nice. See, I just feel you like get food out. Like, okay. At the same time, down. I feel like you, should, you need to get your kind of person because the moment you get your kind of person, these are things you, you have to notice to... before you get married. Yeah, yeah. People don't the check both of you to you like come married. into conclusion and like, say, marriage. babe, this is what I want. If if she can compromise it or he can compromise it, then fine. But if she can't, like, guys, rip up something. Do you guys need to move on? I feel like I don't. Women, women it's it's for the both everybody it's for the both gender no. cooking is not a gender role anymore then because they're in like the 21st century i think you should talk about like the whole thing on instagram like now yeah. so many marriage problems like guys, like bro at the point i was so like am i am i going to marry because a lot of I'll people are in love of my life with all this rubbish and i'm going to spend and forever with you him guys. i'm going and to be amazing so you and guys that's on a period <laughs> sorry also blind people <laughs> Because a lot of married oh my problems God. online. See, my wife did this. Much. My husband did the DNA testing. Like, <laughs> my but like woman actually that bring that another means. child for you. I don't know. It's, and but she even loves like, you. She feels like she was right. That's what that woman. That needle's wife is messing is, in my head. I think she's a psychopath. She needs to be checked. Constantly. Like she even said, hey, I didn't think it was your son. You guys like, are fucking married. That. She said he thought that like, he's the one that assumed. <laughs> Like he assumed some people's audacity, <laughs> so and they are do gone. Is go and do a DNA test on your child. Bro. Make sure really you do a DNA, DNA test, test if you if you don't trust the person or they give you a benefit of doubt. But why should you need you to marry somebody you don't trust? Yeah, but the world is actually so yeah, fucked right. up. People that, change. Yeah, people change at the long run. Yep. But then we are still gonna get married to the love of our life, and yes. we last. And that's on. Anyways, guys, we don't want to bore you guys with too much talk. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Jeez. And please subscribe to my channel. Subscribe. Tell share this video subscribe. with your friends and your family. Yes. I love like you guys. Like and drop a comment, please. Please, please. And tell me what you like to see on my channel. Just drop a comment. Tell me, Viva, this is what you should talk about next time. Anyways, I love you guys. See you guys next time. Get, 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 get,